What up, it's Hazmat with District for Cleveland. Everybody knows Caitlin Clark turned down Ice Cube's $5 million offer to play in the Big Three. But according to the co-founder of the Big Three, she was going to get $10 million over two years, a percentage of team ownership, half of merch revenue, and stake in the Big Three dock with a seven-figure advance. It was going to be at least $15 million. But she'll get her WNBA salary, $338,000 over four years. She did get a sneaker deal with Nike worth $28 million over eight years. That's $3.5 million a year, which is pocket change to a top NBA player with a shoe deal. Some are wondering how she get a shoe deal, and Asia Wilson, who's a two-time WNBA champion, finals MVP, league MVP, all-star, college champion, Olympic champion, doesn't have a shoe deal. So they'll both make between 70 dollars 80000 a year. It's like the WNBA now stands for will not be affluent, or wealthy, no, but A. This has been Hazmat with your dish for Cleveland.